up youtube it's your girl that's her name and today we're back we back back with another youtube video period so right now i'm looking a little busted and crusted but it's okay because right now i'm about to go to the store and I have to get a couple of things, you know, I want to make a vision board, it's 2022, it's summer is coming, spring is coming, and I just want to make a vision board because I, lately, you guys, I feel like I've been slacking, and y'all might not see it, but I feel like my content is not what I want it to be, and I feel like I need to work harder and do better if I want growth, consistent growth, I know I have to do what I have to do as well and i know i have to do my part and i know you guys have to do your part also by subscribing liking commenting you know all that good stuff but right now as i told you guys i'm heading to the store because i want to make a vision board like i said it's 2022 and i want to get a lot of stuff done before 2023 or before this year ends before my birthday comes which is in december i want to do a lot of stuff accomplish a lot of goals so I was like, I know like certain stuff I'd be saying I want to do, you know, in my head and stuff. But I was like, if I see it and I'm looking at it every day, I feel like it's going to motivate me and strive me to do my very best. Because like, you guys, honestly, even though, okay, I would call myself a YouTuber. And it's like, I know I can do like so much better than what I'm doing. Like content wise and interacting with you guys so i can get bigger and y'all can stay consistent so i'm like okay because lately like it's just a little rant it's getting rant but you know i haven't been feeling, like as motivated like to post and stuff and when i do post i feel like i haven't been giving my all like i haven't been feeling it maybe because usually like they tell you like when you're a small youtuber and i'm manifesting that i'm not a small youtuber you know big teens but they tell you like you know don't look at the numbers too much don't look at the analytics too much and it's kind of hard like when you're small like and i'm not saying i'm small because i don't think i'm small but still i don't want to get bigger but it's kind of hard not to look at the analytics and if you guys are youtubers or like starting off you probably can relate like or am I getting views or why am I not getting like enough views? I'm not getting enough um my average view duration, like minutes, it's like really low. And it's like I know it's stuff I can do to, you know, get better, but it's like I don't know, I just have been feeling very motivated to do better. But I'm like, listen, it's the summer, it's not summer, it's spring. I have spring break coming up very soon. I'm going to be taking trips. And the summer is coming. And I know it's going to be my year. And I really want it to be my year. So I know I have to get on the right track. I have to be motivated. And I have to push. And, you know, just push myself hard. Harder. And that might sound weird to some of y'all. Like, oh, you shouldn't have. But I don't see myself doing nothing else besides YouTube. Like, YouTube is something I really enjoy doing. And I really want to do it for a long time. So I know I have to do what I have to do too. Like I know I have to put in the work and all that stuff. But yeah, y'all, that was just a little rant to start off this vlog. But right now I already told y'all I'm going to the store and I'm to get my stuff for my vision board and get a little couple of things too here and there. But here's the Bobiana and she's not flat or nothing. Like I'm literally just going to the store and coming back. So, it might not be, you know, I didn't flat on it or nothing. I just, you know, got in the car and I'm about to go. I feel like I've been talking for so long. So, I'll get back to you guys when I get into the store. Some of this stuff to put around the poster because 
is a white poster and I don't want it to be boring. So yeah, I'm just putting this in the car. So let's move on. And I'm thinking about getting some candles. So let's go ahead and go to the candle aisle. And I already have like like glitter and all that at home, so yeah, let's go to the candle aisle. I don't get coffee right here, but you guys, I'm deciding to get this one. I'll show you it better when I get home, but it smells really good. I really like it. It smells really good, and it looks really aesthetic, so we're going to add this to our cart. Okay, you guys, so I just got back from the store and it's hot AF. It's so hot, you guys. I'm gonna give y'all a little haul of what I got really quick. But there's nowhere, like, literally nowhere to put my phone. Like, y'all, there's nowhere to put my phone. Like, for real. So, I might just show y'all when I get home since there's nowhere to put my phone. I'm gonna look for something real quick. But if I can't find it, then I'll just be back with you guys when I get okay guys so i'm still at the store and i found my purse so let's give y'all the haul really quick so first i got this white poster board y'all already seen y'all it's huge but i got this white poster board that's what i'm going to be creating my vision board on and i already have like markers and stuff at home and glitter and all that so i was like it's no use to buying it if i already have it at home but i did buy this like gold good glitterly bulletin border to like to put on the edge of your board because i didn't want my board to be like even though it's gonna have glitter stuff i didn't want it to be plain so i bought some of these to go around my board and then i bought a candle you guys this is so pretty and it smells really good and it's called vanilla amber sandalwood it's really smells really good and it looks so aesthetic and i'm gonna show you on the back camera when i get home and lastly i bought some baby wipes because yeah if you're not using baby wipes i don't know what you're using in your puppy mail so yeah y'all well, someone just pulled up right next to me yo oh, i hate that it's so awkward but yeah, I'm gonna show you guys the candle and I'll get back with you when I get home. Okay guys, so I showed y'all this stuff and I told y'all I'll be back with that when I get home. But honestly, I really don't feel like listening to music right now. So I'm just gonna talk to you guys, I guess. And just hope that the phone doesn't fall. Because, yeah, I know it's gonna fall, but we're gonna pray that it's not. So I'm gonna back. Well, I'm gonna wait till this car comes and I'm gonna back up and go home. And when I go home, I already cleaned up my room. And I'm just gonna basically just start this poster. Please don't park by me. I thought this lady, man, whatever, is about to park by me, but they didn't. So, yeah. So I just hate when people look at me because don't, don't look at me. Don't look at me. I'm not crazy, but I do assume things. So, yeah, I don't like when people follow me, like, drive-wise. Like, don't, don't, don't do that. But I'm going to hold my phone because I'm, like, in the neighborhood. And hopefully nothing happens. And I'm going to drive slow because I am literally holding up one phone with one hand and then driving with the other hand. But you guys, I think I'm a pretty good driver, so we have nothing to worry about. That's our name. I'm safe. But anyways, you guys, I haven't even welcomed y'all to the channel. So, I know we're like five minutes in or whatever, but what's up, y'all? My name is Des Harnay, and yeah, I just live my life and do YouTube. And if you're new, welcome to the channel. Make sure you subscribe for our lit videos because I'm lit and... If you're a returning subscriber, thanks for coming back. I really appreciate it. And yeah, I'm like literally almost outside of my house. So yeah, 
But I'm going to show you guys my phone case. And if you see my um, video, my writing, my iPhone cases, go watch that if you haven't. But if you haven't seen that, I have on one of the cases from that video. So yeah, I one of the cases on now from that video. So yeah. And yeah, I just got home, you guys. So I'm going to try out the phone case and then I'm going to get the heck off of my phone and just get back to you guys later. This is the phone case, y'all. Just look at the case. Don't look at me. It's really cute. So, yeah. Okay, I'm home and y'all can't see, but I have like all of my stuff set up because I'm about to do my vision board right freaking now. Like I'm about to do it right now not wasting no time so that's the first thing we want to be doing in this video which is creating my vision board and then after that i might do some planning or you know just stuff like that but you guys the pollen is bad like my throat hurts just from being outside for like five minutes and even that like i just was outside to walk to the car and go walk into the store get back into the car and my throat is like hurting. Like I know it's the pollen because pollen is like bad where I'm at. But anyway, so I already showed you guys the um stuff I got from the store. But I also have some other stuff that I didn't get from the store that I had at home. So I have some markers. Have some markers. I have some glue. Some glue. I have glitter. I don't know why this, like, for this stuff to focus, I have to do this. So I have glitter right here. I have more glue. I have these letters, like, it's like I have silver and then I have gold, like, letters just to put on the poster. I have some little rhinestones and I have scissors and tape so yeah you guys I wish I had a printer at home because honestly I would have printed some pictures out and stuff so I can put on the board too maybe eventually I do that I'll do that oh my god I can't talk but I don't know you guys but I'm going to change the angle so you all can see me and what I'm doing. So let me change the angle. Okay, so this is the little angle and whatever. And I have my phone because I'm going to be looking to Pinterest for some ideas. So, yeah, I have all my stuff that I'm going to use. And... I'm just ready to just get started, you guys, because today actually has been a long day. Like, hopefully my energy is not bad, but today has been like a very long and tiring day. Okay, but I still want to get on camera and, you know, because you guys deserve videos and you guys deserve great content. And yeah, so that's really all and uh, I don't know if I'm going to like put on music while I'm making this because I really don't want to talk during the whole thing because there's really nothing for me to talk about at this moment I feel like it'll be more oh look at the candle you guys I love this candle but yeah I don't know so You guys, I just, honestly, I'm just manifesting a better life for myself because, yeah, I'm cutting the board because it's too big, but I'm just manifesting a better life for myself and 
I know I have to put in the work. Like, you can't just manifest or want something to happen and you don't put in the work. Like, you can't say, okay, say if you're a YouTuber like me. You can't say, okay, I want 100,000 subscribers. But, okay, let me, let me make it more reasonable. Like, a little more realistic. Like, when you're manifesting, you can't be like, okay, I'm manifesting. I have... 50,000 subscribers by the end of the year and then just sit up there and do nothing like you don't make your content better you don't have better like I said better content you don't you know have better quality videos like you can't expect something to happen if you're not putting in the work so yeah like I said I'm manifesting that I have, like, you know, a certain amount of subscribers by the end of the year. But at the end of the day, I know I have to put in the work. And the work that I put out reflects, you know, what I get. So I'm like, okay, if I know I'm not putting in any work, then I'm not going to expect for certain things. You know what I'm saying? Versus if I know I'm putting in the work, then I know I'm going to get results that reflect that. So... Yeah, you guys, that's just something in, that I thought about. Because I used to be one of the type of people to manifest stuff. And sometimes it happens, sometimes it don't. But then I would just say it like, okay, I want this. And then I don't work for it. Like, I didn't, or I don't put in the work to get there to what I want. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, this year... Like, it's going to be my best year on YouTube because I'm manifesting it and I know what I'm capable of doing. And yeah, I just want it to be good. I want this year to be great. I want the content to be a hundred times better than last year. I want to grow. So I know I have to put in the work, you know what I'm saying? Like nothing's gonna come easily like youtube is a job like once you're monetized and have your little four thousand subscribers or i mean one thousand subscribers youtube is really a job so it's like work to get where you want to be like that's my mindset work to get where you want to be like youtube wise like i know youtube like i said earlier is the only like thing i see myself doing because i genuinely have a passionate a passion for it. Did I say passion? Oh my god. I have a passion for it and I know since I was like young like maybe like nine years old I always wanted to be famous. Like I always wanted to be famous so really having like this platform even though it's not what I want it to be yet but even having like the support that I do have from you guys I really do appreciate it because like people take it for granted like me honestly i know like like i said i always wanted to be famous so it's like the subscribers that i do have you know it, it really i really appreciate it because i know it's like something that i always wanted and i know what i had to do to get where i'm at even though i'm not where i want to be fully but I still know to get where I'm even at now. I know what I had to do. I know the sacrifices that I had to make. And I'm making sacrifices right now. Like as I'm recording this video. Like I sacrificed something just to record. You know just to do this video. And you know. So yeah. Like life is just. I don't know you guys. I don't know what this video. I don't know what it's about like making my dream board and planning and organizing and stuff but yeah i just wanted to say that to you all because yeah i just wanted to but yeah like youtube like i said it's a job so if you don't put in that i ain't gonna say the x amount of hours but if you don't put in the work what do you expect like, some of you guys are YouTubers that watch me that I know, and you're trying to grow and stuff. And it's like, 
sometimes I actually like check out you guys' channel and be like, okay, this is one of my subscribers, let me go check out their channel. I see they only have like 10 videos, 20 videos, I only post like once every three, five months or something, then just expects to like, have 50,000 subscribers or 20,000. That's not how it works. Every I feel like every one of your favorite YouTubers, like before they got where they are, you can look back on their channel and see what they used to do before they got big. Like I know some YouTubers I watch, I personally go back on their channels to when they were smaller. They had like freaking five videos a week consistent busting in behind so it's like you know working hard so it's like you i feel like you would have to do the same thing too like you know for some people it comes easy and for other people you know you might have to put in a little work like a little more work but honestly if it's what you really want then you should do it like you should really do it like like, one of my favorite YouTubers, he said it'd take him to two and a half years to blow up. And one of my other YouTubers, favorite YouTuber, said it took her, like, three years to blow up. So, it's like, if you really, really have a passion for it and really want to do it, you're going to get where you want to be eventually. Because it's like, you're doing the work, you know, you're putting in the time, you're, you know, you're editing your videos, you know, you're doing good for yourself. So people will start to realize and then bam, next thing you know, there go you with your 100K subscribers, 200K and all of that. So yeah, I'm just ready to get to that point, you guys. And yeah, and you guys, I still, like if you go on like my early videos, like I always said that I want to do a couple channel and I still want to do that like I love couple channels like that's not like I only watch like three couple channels like on YouTube and I love all of them like I still want to make my couple channel y'all I don't care when I get older not right now but you know like if I've been with someone for like years and stuff and you know in a couple of years I already know that I'm gonna be big on YouTube because like I'm already pretty like decent now like so i know in a couple years i'm gonna be big on youtube like i already know like as long as i keep doing what i'm doing now you know being consistent and stuff i know i'm gonna be big on youtube so by that time you know hopefully i can have my couple channel and you guys will follow along hopefully because i just like the couple channels i do watch i really like love the content i'm like oh my god i want to make a couple channel i want to do a couple channel i want to do it so yeah but honestly guys i do want to do a q a with you guys soon so yeah i do want to do another q a you guys i love doing q a's when you guys ask me questions and then i answer the questions i love doing q a's so if you guys want to send me questions like right now you can send them to me on my instagram it's going to be linked down below the name is at famous all let me write on the screen and it's going to be in the description or you can just like comment questions under the video if you want and i'm going to ask you guys if you want a q a too like i'm going to make a community post by the time this video is out so go ahead and go check that community post and comment your questions under there or you can comment it or you can send it to me on Instagram in my DMs. And you can ask me like any question like about YouTube stuff, about my life, personal life. I really don't care. Like as long as it's appropriate, I'll answer the question, you know. But yeah, so I feel like I've been talking a lot, but I have like this much of the border done already. I feel like it looks good, but you guys, I'm going to fast forward a little bit because I'm going to watch a video on YouTube. So, enjoy the background music and finish watching me do my little poster, my little vision board.
Okay, guys, so I'm done with the frame of the board, and it's really cute. I'm, I really like it. This is how it looks, you all. Right here. And so now that I made the little frame, I'm going to go on Pinterest. And I'm going to find some inspiration because there's really, where else could you look besides Pinterest? Pinterest has every freaking thing. So I have to reinstall it on this phone. Oh my God, this phone has nothing. But let me go ahead and clean. I'm going to start, I'm going to clean up as I go, you guys. Because I don't feel like later on, I'm not going to feel it. So... Let's just go ahead now. Clean up as we go. Still gonna need the glue. Okay, so I'm on Pinterest and let me the vision board ideas. I found this little vision board worksheet, you guys on Pinterest and I'm gonna end up printing pictures out too so I might do that tomorrow at school and I'll just like maybe insert the clip for you guys or if y'all don't see it then y'all see it in the next video for sure but um So yeah, I'm definitely gonna print some pictures out. So yeah, but right now I'm just gonna write some stuff that I found on Pinterest. So this one says dream career. I'm basically gonna have like different categories. So one is gonna say wealth. The other one is gonna say health. The other one is gonna say love. Let me try the L for love. Okay, I got an L for love. And I don't know going to say career. And those are the ones I'm going to focus on right now. So, definitely have to print some pictures, y'all. I don't know why I didn't think about this. Like, I don't know. But first, I'm going to start with wealth. So, let me get the W. So I have the W and I'm using these silver letters I already showed you guys earlier. Should I get up and show you guys right now or am I being lazy? I guess I'll get up for you guys. These are the letters that I'm using. So I'm going to use the W for wealth, then like C for career, H for health, L for love, and just stuff like so let's continue. Okay, you all. So I'm done with the vision board for now. Like I said, I'm going to go back and add images just to make the, you know, board pop more. But... So I wrote a couple of things on it. And my bad if I'm looking to the side, I'm looking in the mirror. I'm gonna start looking in the camera. So I wrote a couple of things. I'm just gonna read to you guys what I wrote. So I put wealth from one category and I said, I have multiple, it's basically I wrote like affirmations, like affirmations. So I said, I am grateful for my YouTube career. I am a famous YouTuber. I have over 500k subscribers. I am a money magnet. I enjoy multiple streams of income belonging to me. So those are the little affirmations I wrote on the wealth. I mean, I can go on and on. But, you know, those just like some. And for health, I put I am healthy. And I put I enjoy exercising every week for my health. And then for goals, I put... 50k subscribers by the end of 2022 and I put affirmations so the rest are affirmations 
So I say I aspire to be a blessing and inspire others. So I aspire to be a blessing and an inspiration to others, basically. And I said I am. Uh, what this say? Y'all can even read. I am determined to succeed. I am grateful. And yeah, those are just a couple of things that I wrote. And I don't know where I'm going to put it at in my room yet. Like, I'm going to end up putting it somewhere. I'll find a spot for it. So, yeah, you guys. And I'm thinking, like, I'm really thinking about going to Starbucks. Like, it's currently 5.52. Let me see what time they close. Now, you guys, should we go to Starbucks? Should we go? And I'm going to get my little tripod. Let me get it right now. My tripod right here. So, I can set you guys up in the car. And when we come back, I'm going to start on um, planning and organizing. So let me go ahead and get my journal. So I have my journal right here and I have my pen. So I'm just going to put it on the bed on top of my little vision board. And when I get back, I'm going to start doing that. But this is the candle, you guys. I know you can see it earlier. It's really, really cute. Like, look at it. So cute, y'all. But... Let me go ahead and find a drink that I'm going to get. Because every time I go to Starbucks, I try new drinks. I might just get a basic drink. Because, like, when I be adding all this stuff, it'd be, like, extra money. And I'm like, no. So, let me go to Starbucks menu. Like, I'm, like, I'm just going to get something simple. Like, I know I'll be trying different stuff. But it's, like, usually I get, like, a small which is the what is the small the grandi grandi venti what's the other size <laughs> y'all yeah, i'm not gonna start about to lie and i don't even know you yeah, guys i'm gonna order it on my phone that i'm recording off of and i'll just be back to you guys when i get into the car so yeah let's go to starbucks let's go Okay, you guys, so I did decide to come to Starbucks, and I don't want this video. This video is already freaking long, so I'm getting a strawberry acai with lemonade and cold foam, vanilla cold foam, so I'll just show you the drink when I get it, because it's literally just, I don't know. I'll just show you when I get it, so bye. So I'm back and I got a Binti strawberry sai with lemonade with two pumps of vanilla cold foam light ice. And this is the first time I'm trying this, so hopefully it's good. So let's try it. It's good. It's good. I like it. Kind of tastes like a pink drink. Like, if you ever taste a pink drink, that's what this tastes like. Okay, you guys. So, the quality is probably bad right now and shaky. Please stop shaking. I'm using this tripod and it's crazy. But I didn't go to Starbucks because I just, I don't know. I feel like, I don't know, you guys. I just didn't go. But I might end up going. I don't know. Don't quote me. But right now, I have my journal, and I'm about to write, like, three affirmations. But well, actually, I'm not going to write no affirmations because I literally just wrote some on the board. So, I'm just going to plan, like, I guess I'll just, like, write down some video ideas that I want to do soon. I can do like summer, spring. I'm going to write down spring video ideas. Spring. Do y'all want to see video ideas? So I just wrote down spring video ideas right here for when I go on spring break and so spring break is like next week you guys so i'm gonna write down spring ideas i know i'm taking a trip like i'm going somewhere so i know i'm going to do like um a traveling 
Okay, I'm gonna do a pack with me. Okay, let's write that. See if we get anything done. Okay. Vacation pack with me. Pack with me for my vacation. Vacation pack with me. I'm trying to see which one sounds right, you guys. Pack with me for my vacation or a vacation pack with me. I think pack with me for my vacation sounds better. Pack with me for my spring break vacation. Okay, so I wrote down pack with me for my spring break vacation. That's one video. Then I can do, um, see, I was going to do a spring try on haul, sheen try on haul, but I feel like I should just wait till the summer and do like a summer try on haul because, yeah, like, until I get paid again or like start getting like a whole bunch of sponsors, like I'm not planning on spending like over a hundred dollars or something. So I might just wait till the summer to do that haul, the trial haul. But yeah, so we I have a pack with me for my spring break vacation. Then I'm going to do what else can we do, you guys? See, like you guys, us YouTubers when we plan our videos, like sometimes it takes a long time because it's like you guys, the camera is so shaky. Like, I might as well just sit it on something. Like, it's going to be this shaky. Like, I didn't know it was going to be this freaking shaky. So, I'm going to change the angle, you guys. Because I don't like how it's shaking. I don't like when the camera's, like, shaky a lot. It really annoys me. Okay, so, this is somewhat better. Because the camera's not shaky. So, I already had the pack with me. For my spring break vacation. I'm not going to tell you guys what I'm going to get. Because I'm going like different places. Like I'm not just going to one place. Then of course I'm going to do a vlog. I don't know if I should do a spring break vlog. See but the vlog. I want to do like different spring break vlogs. So I can do like a. Blank city. Spring break vlog. I'm not going to say out the city. But like for example, I can do like a Miami spring break vlog or like a something like that. So I'm going to write that. And you guys, I'm definitely vlogging this spring break because last year I was supposed to vlog for spring break, but I didn't. So this year, I don't care how much fun I'm having. I'm going to freaking record because I want to. And I just want to document it so I can always, like, look back on it. And plus, I want you guys to see, you know, what I'm doing on my spring break. So, we got two video ideas for spring. Then I can do a... What else I can do? Week in my life spring break edition. Yeah, week in my life spring break edition. Y'all remember really giving me y'all video ideas, like... Okay, so now we got three video ideas, and I can do a, hmm, I could do a day of my life, too. I can do a day of my life and write that down. Y'all, I'm definitely recording for Spring Break. Like, every place that I go, I'm recording, I don't care. Just because, like I said, last year I didn't, so I feel like I have to. Like, it would be wrong if I don't record because maybe my subscribers from last year from spring break maybe they were like okay that's her name you said you post the next spring break for real so they're probably ready like ready and i can do like a beach vlog should i do a beach vlog a beach vlog would be nice All right beach vlog beach vlog um what else can i do you guys so right now we got one, two, three, four, five video ideas right here. So I'm gonna repeat them back. One, pack with me for my spring break vacation. Two, blank spring break vacation vlog. So for example, Miami spring break vacation vlog. Three, week of my life spring break edition. Four, day of my life spring break edition. Five, beach vlog. Okay, that's that's good. Goodbye videos y'all gonna get in the spring.
So make sure you turn on the notification bell and subscribe if you have not. Okay. So yeah, you guys, that's just five video ideas. I just came up the top of my head. Like, definitely gonna do these. And what else can I do, you guys? Like, like you guys, like I literally sit and just brainstorm, like just write stuff down, like video ideas and stuff all the time. Like, I feel like me, I'm the type of person I would never run out of video ideas because I'm always like thinking. Like, coming up with stuff, like, always. Like, always. Like, even if I'm, like, have nothing to do, I'm going to make something to do. Like, I'm going to just throw something. I'm going to throw something together, but I'm going to, like, think, like, okay, what can I utilize, you know, to make a video? Like, with a perfume collection and stuff, like, I'm like, okay, I have no video ideas. Oh, wait, I know I have a lot of perfume, so why not do a perfume collection to show the people show you guys what i have and you know so i did that and yeah those are just some of the video ideas that i'm gonna do this is good for now because i can't think of nothing else right now i'm gonna write these in my phone too so yeah that's all i have for now y'all this is a good setup i might start doing some videos like this like I know I always do my videos, like, in a certain spot. And it's still the same background, but I feel like, you know, this is cute. This is classy. So, I'm going to start doing my videos, like, right here, you guys. This is so freaking cute. But, y'all, I think that's really all I'm doing for the video, y'all. Look at my candle. I'll, I'm obsessed with this freaking candle. Like, it smells so good, too. I'm obsessed. I'm freaking obsessed. So, I'm going to put my candle up somewhere and... Yeah, but honestly, you guys, I know I put organizing in the title. I'm not really organizing nothing. I already organized something on camera. I guess I'll just show you what I organized. But you guys, let me know down in the comments if you like this setup. This is really cute. Like, I never thought about doing my videos like this. Like, y'all know what angle I do my videos on. It. Or if you're new, you don't know. But if you go watch my other videos, you'll see what I'm talking about. But this is really it's just really it's giving so i really like it but i'm gonna show you guys that i organized my little makeup corner so let's go ahead and show you guys that real quick yeah this is the little makeup corner i was talking about and yeah i just organized it because it was really messy so yeah this is what i was talking about but let me put the lighting over here because i'm about to end this video like this video is way too long. Hopefully, you guys actually sit and watch the video. But, you guys, like I said, this is the end of the video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share this video if you're feeling genuine. And, yeah, make sure you go for my Q&A community tab post and leave your questions under there. Or you can easily DM me on my Instagram and leave me a little DM, like, question you want to ask. And I might post it on my story. I don't know yet. But yeah, you guys. So, I mean, I hope you enjoyed this video. That's the most important. And that's all I have to say. So, I get my little, um, whatever dress here too. But with that being said, that's how I am out.